Hi friends, the aim of the test is to determine the linear density of the yarn taken from the woven fabric. We will find the yarn's mass per unit length in order to obtain its linear density value. For this, we condition our sample for 24 hours. The sample is laid on a flat surface so that we can cut a part of 50 centimeters long from it. While cutting the sample, we pay attention to take from 150 millimeters inside its edge. We adjust the sample's width so that 10 yarns could be taken out of it when needed. Our sample parallel to the weft is used as a weft sample and the sample whose long edge is parallel to the warp is used as a warp sample. While taking our samples, we mark five samples, each including different weft and warp yarns. Our sample is taken from unwrinkled areas. We cut the sample from the fabric according to the drawn line. While drawing the sample, we make sure that it is drawn in the same direction to the weft yarn. The yarns of the sample that are drawn in the direction of the weft are removed. We take out 10 yarns from the 50 cm long sample. 10 yarns from each of the prepared 5 samples are taken out. Then, the actual length of the yarn is measured. We should take the yarn out in a free manner, that is, without stretching it. This process is repeated for the weft and warp yarns separately. We find the actual length of the yarn that is removed from the 50 cm long sample. Since the length belongs to 10 yarns, the obtained value is multiplied by 10. Then we weigh it in a precise balance. We prepare groups of 10 samples from a total of 50 samples that have been taken out of the fabric. Before weighing our samples, we condition them in standard atmospheric conditions. We weigh our conditioned samples with the precise balance. Firstly, we ensure that the precise balance is at zero. On the screen, we read values for 10 samples in grams and we record the values. Since we use 10 yarns in the sample, a single sample's actual length is multiplied by 10. Then we find the linear density of the yarn in tex by using the formula. Alternatively, the tex number can be calculated automatically with the help of recently developed computer programs. To have it done, the sample's data is put into the computer program. The yarn's determined length, that is 53 centimeters, is multiplied by 10. The result of the multiplication is put into the computer program. We go into the testing process after the screen is reset. In this computer program, the text of the number, denier, metric number, 
British and French numbers are automatically calculated. The sample's weight and number have already been determined in grams and tecs respectively. The output on the screen is automatically passed to the computer program and it translates the weight to the respective yarn number. After accepting this sample, we weigh five samples of the weft and warp directions. The test can be performed while considering all 50 samples together instead of doing it with groups of 10 samples.